The Way of the Weedy Sea Dragon, written by Anne Morgan and Lois Berry. Strange creatures live off the southern coasts of Australia. These brightly coloured fish with spots and bars are poor swimmers, but excellent dancers. Do you believe in dragons? With their fiery colours, long snouts and tails, weedy sea dragons look like fairy tale dragons, but they are much smaller. They have no scales, teeth, legs or wings. They can't breathe fire, but they have other talents. Their eyes can move in different directions as they watch for food or predators. Weedy sea dragons are masters of camouflage. They can change colours to blend with the sea plants around them. Their leafy appendages sway like seaweed in the currents, disguising them from predators. Can you see one now? And now? Camouflage is not the sea dragon's only protection. Their mouths are too small to take fishing baits. They have hard body plates beneath their skin. And they're probably not the tastiest of seafoods but fish may still nibble the sea dragon's fins and eat their eggs or larvae. Octopuses can prey on them. Seals may play with them. Their body plates allow some movement, but they cannot swim fast and flexibly like most other fish. To keep their balance and move around, sea dragons beat their frilly neck fins and back fins. Sea dragons hitch rides on ocean currents, steering with their tails as they hunt sea lice, fish larvae and mycids. Their snouts are narrow tubes that end in toothless mouths. They suck in their prey by snorting seawater. They take oxygen from the snorted seawater too and squirt wastewater through circular gill openings below their heads. One morning in spring, this female hunts in a giant kelp forest. One eye keeps watch for tiny prey. The other eye swivels to watch for male sea dragons. Two sea dragons are gliding out of the kelp, swaying slowly, leaning, twisting, performing a graceful courtship dance above a seagrass meadow. Fanning their fins, bending their tails, they mirror each other's moves. They dance on through the silver light of dusk. When the watery light dissolves, they are still dancing. Gliding through the dark waters, they nudge each other towards the surface. The female releases a string of eggs. The eggs catch on a sticky patch beneath her partner's tail. He flicks his tail again and again. A few eggs are lost, but most stick tight to his brood patch. The mother drifts away, but she may come back to help him protect their eggs from hungry fish. The father guards their treasures. His tail grows cups to protect each egg. Inside the eggs, 
yolk sacs feed the growing embryos. When eyes appear through the soft egg membranes, hatching time is near. The hatchlings unroll and wriggle out, tail first. The father shakes his tail to help them hatch. The babies with their bulging bellies tumble and drift like tiny scraps of seaweed. Their yolk sacs will feed them for the next two days until their snouts grow and they can teach themselves to hunt and hide. In two years, the young sea dragons will be mature enough to find mates and grace the seas with their own weedy sea dance. Mothers will pass their eggs to the fathers who will guard and hatch their living treasures.